Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of the new save file. We are jumping in again and this time I'm going to go as Tainted Kane and there is a reason for that. So I'm going to play as him on... He's going to be really overpowered on Greedier, I think. In fact, it's going to be insanely overpowered on Greedier, but let's give it a go anyway. So I just want to show something off. Uh, for one, I want to play this character because he is fun with this, but as you can see, he now starts with modeling clear. Um, I found out how to do it. For those of you wondering, I can maybe show you now. Um, basically, wait, 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 wait. You could, okay, how, how, how am I going to do this? How am I going to do this? Um, display capture, maybe? And then turn off game capture? I, I don't know how to do this. Um, okay, no, this isn't how you do this. I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't know how to do it. I'll, I'll, if someone reminds me, I'll put a comment. Basically, you've just got to paste a bit of code into the retribution main.lua near the top, and that's it. And it works. It's pretty awesome. But anyways, it means that we can have that. It's mine now. <laughs> um, we'll take the soul heart, I think. Uh, we'll take the key. We'll suck up all the money. And don't get to have that Iameter either. I'm going to take another soul heart here. We'll suck all of that up. Um, I'm going to take another key here. And away we go. Basically, modeling clear. We kind of spoke about this before. Hold up. Wait a minute. Someone ain't right. <laughs> Excuse me? Excuse me, dude. The soul hearts. The soul hearts right now. Very nice. So basically... We've discussed this in previous episodes. Tainted Kane is just not a fun character, in my opinion. Just not fun at all. And so, one run I gave myself modeling clear on someone's suggestion, and it made the character a lot more fun. Basically, it means once per floor, you can... Uh, you get to keep one item. You essentially get to uh, actually have one of the items that shows up rather than it turning into consumables. Um, and because of that, we decided to continue using that, and now I found a way to give it as a as a starting item. Now, in some ways, it's a little overpowered because it lets you steal from shops and it lets you steal devil deals. Um, so it is a little bit overpowered in that way, and I would like to potentially make a nerf for it, uh, specifically with Tainted Kane, where it maybe gives a broken heart or it deals one damage or something like that whenever you use it to ha have it have some level of downside. Um, but... It's going to make the character more fun, if a little bit overpowered. So we're going to play as him, and we haven't done a uh, thingy yet, so why not? Oh, dude. This uh, item that we've made already is pretty pretty goddamn good. And yeah, Ghost Pepper here, I just had to take, because Ghost, Pe Ghost Pepper's pretty amazing. But yeah, we're going to be turning enemies into... Um, get a Blood Vial there, we can use for some damage up, nice. We're going to be turning enemies into um, coins every now and again, because of the Slick Spade that we just got, which is... Pretty damn lovely, I've got to say. Uh, we're going to be bleeding enemies. The fires are going to be good. This is this is just going to all be good, I think. I accidentally stood on the button there. God damn it. A foolish, foolish boy has been born today. We are going to pick up money here. Um, it's not always going to be the most obvious or valuable choice, but I'm going to do it sometimes. I'm not sure which one it is that we need to do. Uh, I think it's the... that one. <laughs> it's that one. To turn enemies into gold. It's not going to happen super often. But it's kind of happened often enough. This is a, a very good start with this guy. And like I said. The ability to steal from shops is going to be rather strong. I still can't believe that we got modeling clear. As our, one of our first shop items. That's kind of crazy. That's so funny. Yeah we get charm and stuff like that. Slick Spade is just really good in general. Really good in general. You get away from me. These little ghosts are a bit annoying here. As for the question of the day to day. Um... What's a skill in life that you learn really late? For example, I didn't learn how to ride a bike until I was like eight, and like literally everyone else I knew had been riding a bike since I was like five, so I, I, I feel like I was pretty late to the party with that one. Some people like learn how to swim really late, stuff like that. What, what's like your skill that you were late to the party with? I feel like everyone's got everyone's got one. I need to stop hurting myself in really dumb ways. But yeah, I feel like everyone's got one, Um, so I guess we'll buy this. Um... Honestly, I'm going to take some bombs here. They seem pretty useful. I'll suck up a soul heart. I'll suck that up. And I guess I'll suck up this red heart as well, because why not? And let's continue on. We should Bosses, honestly, should be super easy for us here, because we've got all these status effects going on. And then um, on top of that, we've got the fires on occasion. And the fires do amazingly good damage. So I'm not worried about that. 
Okay, let's let's try and get one penny in here. Oops. Unfortunately, not very good. Oh, bugger. Huh. Uh, yeah, Rainbow Baby, why not? More status effects. I am down for more status effects. Get hurt by fire more, please. You're getting on my nerves now. Get hurt by more of my fires. But yeah, more status effects seems good to me. He be gold. I don't know if gold bosses give more. Didn't get to find out. We'll be going... Actually, I just say we'll be going Angel Deal. Yeah, we will be going Angel Deal. It makes more sense, right? Unfortunately, this combination of uh, bosses is pretty rough. Luckily, it did not matter. <laughs> right, down we go. Good stuff. We could bomb these to get some stuff. I'll see what I get from my first one to see if it's any value. Yeah, no, 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 no. I'll, I'll hold off on the other bomb. But yeah, again, we can steal something here. So let's uh, go into our shop and see if we want to take something with modeling clay. So that I'll just buy, I think. Is that the eraser up there? That is the, that's the reflected eraser. Which is actually pretty valuable to us, but we would have to play this guy that costs keys. Why does he have to cost keys? Very frustrating. Bomb this guy. Not what I was expecting, but... Probably actually kind of useless. Uh, I'll take this, because it's cheap. Um, I will take the soul heart and the rest of this I can put in my bag. Right. Is there anything in here we want to steal? So this book, we don't particularly care for. I'll take these bombs and the rest of this. Ooh, no, I don't really care for that too much. Belly button is two trinkets, I guess. I guess that could be good. Ooh, fat, big fats plus fat penny is kind of interesting. Ooh, this is maybe the one that I want to keep, right? Um... I'm going to hold off on that for now. What I'm going to do is I'm going to get a bunch of these items and basically roll until I get one that's worth keeping. And see how that goes. That might not be the best tactic in the world, but it's what I'm going to try. Make sure we kill whoever's turned into uh, gold, because we get money out of those guys. And sometimes you only get one coin, but you can get up to, I think, five. So it can be really, really beneficial. Poop boys. These guys are so goddamn good for, um... Can we put these in? Yeah, that counts as a card. Nice, okay. Oh, dude, yes. Oh. Okay, th this trinket combination is pretty god tier. I had never thought about how good this would be. I didn't realize it produced poison farts. I thought it would just make the normal farts larger. But that's, uh... That's really nice. That's a, a two trinket combo. It's the only two trinkets we've found thus far that is actually genuinely very, very strong. I'm liking this. I am liking this a lot. Okay, these are the ones that we can turn into gold pretty easily. Come on now. Do what I want you to do. One of you. There you go. That's what I'm looking for, baby. That's what I'm looking for. Right. So it's going to be a little hard to pick up all these pennies. Let's just take 14 for now, and we'll buy that. And that gave us a bunch more money. Uh, go with that. Put them two in there. Back up to 14, I think. God damn, we're going to be pushing things around like crazy. Good, good. That is terrible look. Oh my god, dude. Bro stuff here. A HP up... Dude, this game sometimes, I swear. Yeah, that's better. I'll take that. This is probably what I want to take, so I'll do that. Gimme, gimme. Gimme, gimme. Can I get to these keys? I can. Huzzah. Right. And that's pretty good too. I'll take that. Thank you. We've got a luck penny there. I think I'll take that. I'll take the key as well here. Bombs I'll pick up. All of this I'll pick up. Cool. Right. 
Then let's leave these pennies here because they can be used for combat. We'll see if he shows up next to any of these. Okay, this is... We got, we got a good thing going on here. I'm liking this. It's a pretty fun greed mode run we've got going on right now. I have to say. Oh, we've goldified him as well. We're not going to be able to kill him while he's gold, but still. Excuse me, sir. Excuse me. Cool. Oh, wait. I just realized as well, every time we fart, we shoot out a fire. So this is like a triply synergistic. We actually got the golden kill on that guy as well. Nice. Yeah, we, fight, we fire out a fire in a random direction whenever we fart as well. So this is really good. I think it's kind of crazy that it can push bosses around as well. Lovely. We got our angel deal here. We'll see what that rewards us with. I'll take both of the HPs. I'll pick that up. Not very happy with that. We'll put one of those in there. It's just counted as a normal heart, annoyingly enough. Although that's actually a decent thing. It's not great, but it's good enough. Right. And over here we go. <laughs> I find it crazy how much it pushes them around. Need seven coins. There you go. Zealot heart? I guess I'll pick up a zealot heart. And the rest of this can get in the bag. That's more fires. Peppermint is uh, freezing fires, so I like that. I wonder if that works with our farting as well. That'd be pretty awesome. Anyhow, I think that's as good for this floor. Away we go. I'm curious to see how those fires work with farting as well. Because if they both fire out those fires whenever I fart, this is going to be a, a, a very peculiar and out of the blue synergy that I'm very happy about. Right, let's go in here. Um, sorry. I'm eating a peach ring right now. It's a sweet. It's very nice. Thick. Tear detonator. Hey, blood clot's good. Coolio, Julio. Uh, that's pretty good. We'll leave that there for now. Squeezy is also pretty good. I think I'm going to take eye drops. I think eye drops is slightly better. So let, let's copy eye drops. Gain that. Eternal Heart I'll put in here, see what we get. Don't know what this item does. Is there any way I can check? No, I guess I'll create it anyways and we'll see. Keeper's Annoying Fly. F3 to hide this. Keeper's Annoying Fly didn't actually show up there as an item we gained, which is slightly annoying. I'm going to pick up all of this. Okay, it doesn't unfortunately shoot out the Freezy Fires as well, but that's... I guess that's fine. But yeah, I swear the Keeper's Annoying Fly can... Give us more, um, give us more gold. More money on occasion. Oh, dude, the freezing here is, uh, pretty top-notch. Pretty top-notch. You get out of here, you. We are freezing just about everything that comes our way. The most unlikeliest of synergies. You guys were born in farts. Why do farts hurt you? That was a little close with that guy. Oh god, I didn't realise that guy was going to create a annoying little fella there. I don't create enemies on my account, please. Look how much distance there is on that poison. Look at that. It's crazy. Right, uh, is there any reason to buy anything here? I feel like buying stuff unless it's, like, on sale isn't really a great idea. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to re-roll 
hoping for a half price item. Which I realize isn't exactly the best tactic here. Um, I guess at this point, let's, let's, let's just not buy anything this floor. We're just, waste, we're just throwing good money after bad. I think I accidentally pressed the button there as well. Yeah, I did. My bad. Oh, this boss is super annoying. Thank God we froze him. Ah, ha, ha. The, the, the amount of fires that we throw at things right now is absurd. I actually just can't believe how good this poop, this uh, butt penny's energy is. I don't think I've ever had butt penny be this valuable for me. It's kind of amazing. I mean, this the, the other trinket as well, the guy Giganta Bean, is also one that's so rarely valuable that it's, it's kind of crazy to see a run where both of them are so good together. Because like, if this was a regular run as well, it wouldn't be effect as effective. Like, it's only as effective as it is because it's Creed mode. Um, what? That was confusing. <laughs> Slightly confusing. Right. Don't care too much about that. I will, however, take the money. Good. good. Lump of coal is pretty good. See what's in the shop there, shall we? Blue cap. Blue cap is also pretty good. Yeah, I'll take blue cap. Good fire rate increase and a health increase. I think that's pretty good going. And take that money. Put the rest in here. Ooh, smooth stone. Hell yes. Right. Now we should probably start buying some stuff. Let's let's re-roll the... Try and get the half price again. All shop items will act as if they're free. Picking up a shop item will remove one charge. Okay, that's pretty good. Oh, I'm stupid. That's not how that works. <laughs> I'm stupid. I need to use more than clay on that, but... Yeah, whatever. Okay, I guess we'll just spend some money now. Oh, shit. I forgot I could destroy these guys with fires. I always forget that. Uh, I can play you a little bit, actually, can't I? Unuseful, you spawn a collectible, black heart, card, spider, based on luck. Okay, it doesn't matter. It's gone. Mum's heal, no thank you. Coupon is good, but no thank you. It's not that good, but it is some tier rate. I think I managed to buy that by putting it in my bag there. That's kind of stupid. Oops. Don't know what this does. I ended up buying something again there. Fatty fly, why not? Just go with a bit of big fan in there. Okay. Move that bomb over and destroy all the icy boys. Oh my god. I was in a bad location for that there. I think we're in a run where we could pretty easily kill Big Man himself. I think this run's pretty good with all the all the fires we got going on. I'm hoping we can increase our luck some more. I think the more we increase our luck the better things are going to be for us, because that means more fires. I mean, we're still getting a lot of them already, but more is always better. Beautiful stuff, though, this is. With the big farts coming in as well. By the way, push one down to the bottom of the screen here, so we can just do that. Kill everything. Yeah, that didn't do anything, sadly. Okay, let's not keep getting hit. I mean, I'm getting a lot of soul hearts from buying items here, but be a little more careful. Beautiful. Goddamn, the fire damage is very good. The fire should absolutely wreck this guy's armor. Luckily, we the uh, icy fires seem to linger for a long time. This guy has been a bit tricky at the minute. 
hoping we cut through his armor soon, but it seems to be taking a rather long time. Ah, my god. They're shooting at me a lot and leaving a lot of creep about. Dude, this is a lot of creep. Ha I swear, it, sometimes Skolix just feels like he's absolutely broken in this modded version. Like, the armor's got to be broken by now. What's going on? I might just debug kill him in a second, because this is taking forever. Like, we've not dealt any damage to him yet. It's just hitting his armor. With all this fire. My god. Like, trying to shoot maybe his tail is better, but... Doesn't seem to be doing any difference. It's a super cool rework to Skorlex as well. I just wish it was more consistent. Because sometimes it works fine, other times it doesn't. Like, do I need to use a bomb on him, maybe? Nah. Yep, it's debug 10 time. Sorry. I don't know why that guy's still so buggy. It's been so long and he still isn't fixed. I don't know what that's about. Oh, dude, there's so much creep everywhere. That's my main thing I'm taking damage to at the minute. I keep getting hit by creep. Just, just pile up the fires there. Okay, nice and easy. Angel deal, thank you. Unfortunately, I wish I'd have saved my thing for Revelation here, but... Hey, her. Right. To the next floor, me thinks. Red candle. Um, no thanks. Sadly, we're getting a lot of poopy poopy stuff. Another peach ring for me, I think. Is this the last one of the pack? No, there's one more. One more. Mm -mm -mm. I'll have a key. Heck. Alright, unfortunately this time we don't know what we're getting. It says just wait a little bit. There you go. Baleful Heart is pretty damn good. Obviously, we'll take the key. Take what? Oh, wait a minute. I can't make any items on this floor because I might get rid of my uh, active, so this is annoying. Yep, can't make any items this floor, otherwise we'll just end up losing. Latch key. Hey, it's luck. It's something. More luck. I know I can't craft items here, but... With this, I can get health. Which is my main goal here. And sometimes you can get more money back. Right. You see, this this worked out pretty well. Oh my god, there's so much stuff in this corner over here. Oh, the farts are a little, little annoying in this room. <laughs> little annoying in this room. Okay, let's leave that as it is. We got plenty of keys. We got plenty of bombs out of that. There's pennies goddamn everywhere. For the next floor, I guess. I was hoping to get more luck pennies, but... Honestly, getting up to three luck here is pretty good going, I'd say. Give me the rest of those bombs. And we'll try and keep going with this golden penny as long as we can. Okay, it's gone. Doesn't matter. Right, okay. Then we just play through this as normal. Play through it as normal. Take the money where we can. Pick up that in there. Because it might be useful. 
We're going to get another fairly useless angel deal, but it could give us an eternal heart or whatnot, so that's good health at least. Although we've already got one, so that's actually not that useful. Oh, it's one of you. Hello. Oh. Got a black heart there as well. Nice. Hey, it's been good stuff. This has been a very, very comfortable run. I'm very glad we got our fires going on. The fires are my favourite part of this run. Less a fan of those fellas. Okay. Fires, go! Oh. Sadly not this time. Ooh, managed to gold that guy. Perfect timing. Unfortunately, I can't hit him when he's split off back into his normal self. He's dead. You are permanently poisoned by all the coins. There you go. Sit in the fire. Bask in it. There you go. Nice. And last little one here. Okay. Slowing this guy down while he's diving across the screen is pretty useful. Okay. Nice. We've got a devil deal, unfortunately. Bunch of stuff that we don't even know as well. Not ideal, but we will head away. A little bit of shame we couldn't craft on that floor. That curse really kind of shafts us. Got a broken stopwatch here. Um, I think we'll take chaos here. As our item. And then start re-rolling to actually get some good stuff. Although, now that I think about it, that wasn't that valuable, right? <laughs> Although we got a half price thing here, so golden bombs, I guess we'll take that. Okay, right. Let's start scooping stuff up. Let's put a soul heart instead of a coin in here. We get the halo, lovely. Pick up all the coins if we can. Really, it's going to spawn two bosses in here. You sure about that? You sure you want to do that? You sure about that's why? Yeah, didn't think so, boys. Didn't think so. Like, give me all the pennies. Justice, you can... Oh shit, that, that still damaged me? God damn it. Just about, but annoying. <laughs> this is chaos. Oh, dude. Got three nickels out of that item. The nickels are pretty awesome. Yeah, the nickels are pretty awesome. So this spirals out of control, as you can clearly see. Damn it, the chili pepper. I would have wanted that. Right, okay. Let's start scooping some stuff up. Took a speed down by accident. Not what I meant to do. Oh ho ho, Play-Doh cookie. Yes, please. We got confessionals, no thank you. Oil baby, no thank you. Greg the egg, hell yes. Charge key in there. Gemini, why not? Bring him to the party. Sprinkler? At this point, Sprinkler is going to be better for us. We'll take Sprinkler. Crack the sky, no thank you. Tito Peeler, no thank you. The Onk, I guess? Uh, 
I guess. Right. Let's go. And does my sprinkler? My sprinkler does shoot fires as well. Okay, this is good stuff. This is good stuff. I don't know where he went. He went zooming off the screen. Pretty funny. And make sure we got a charge for the boss as well. This ended in ways I didn't expect, but I'm, I'm happy. Ooh, hands. I'm so spooked and scared. What are they ever going to do to me? Like, that, that top area is just so full of fire. There's, like, nothing they can do. One second. Oh, my God. Itchy arm. Eat peach ring. Mmm. Yes. But, yeah, we've had friends over for the past four or five days. And we just, take, we just took them to all of our favorite restaurants over the course of four days. And it was, like, the most delicious time of my life. We just ate it everywhere that I absolutely love. It was... It was bliss. It was pure bliss. Um, I should have taken more photos and put them on Discord, but I forgot. I was too hungry. Too damn hungry. Don't let these guys get the best of me. Oh my god. Th these icy fires need to last. Like, need to, they need to work the way blue fires do, like, from the chili pepper I've already got, the ghost pepper, where they fade away. Because they linger for way too long. Dude, I keep getting dimes. Beautiful stuff. We'll probably get one more out of this. Maybe more than one more. I didn't realize how much money was over there. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Penny keeps chasing. Do you know what? While we're doing this, maybe I should just drop my trinkets in another room. <laughs> Probably make things a lot easier. Yeah, it does. The screw. Charm the vampire, why not? Gimme and gimme. Pop it again. Fill my bag full of treats. Another charm of the vampire. Ooh, damn, I think we're all out. Blue map doesn't do much for me. Lawn darts is good. Jesus juice is nice. Okay. I think we're good to go. I think we're good to go. Let's let's take these again. Because these have been very good to us. And we will hippity hop off. To the great outdoors of the next floor. Got these lawn darts coming out as well for this bludgeoning thing. Cool. Right, it's go time. It is go time. I'm just going to quickly do this. Ooh, steam sale. Yes, why not? Okay, sprinkler, you can go there. This is all just going to be about placing as many fires as we possibly can absolutely everywhere. We also have 38 bombs we can use, which... 
I haven't really considered it as a valid tactic, but it very much is. As much as it is going to be kind of hard to actually hit these bombs. Ooh, the frozen enemies are kind of really good at stopping that guy in his tracks there. The fact that the sprinkler throws out fires as well makes it very valuable for us. Okay, got a little bit of healing off of the back of that. S slightly hard to tell what's mine and what's his with the bludgeoning tears coming out everywhere from the lawn darts. Okay. Keep him in the corner there. Yeah, we've done a very, very good amount of damage to this guy. Ah, he got two heals off there. Once again, but the heals aren't going to save him. Okay, throw some icy boys at him as well. Get some bombs out there. I got hit by something. I'm not entirely sure what, but it's fine. Okay. Tried to keep those guys in place, the heads, so he can't ch uh, charge me, but didn't really work. Ow. Ow. Taking a lot more damage than I should on this phase, to be honest. It's fine, he's pretty much dead. I managed to absorb that penny right at the end there. Okay. There's so much fire out here that I don't think he's going to get a chance to do much. He's going to hit me with some explosions here and there, but... I really don't think it's going to be enough to do any significant amount of damage. I think second phase, a lot of his attacks, the explosions, only do half heart damage anyways. It does kind of save you a little bit. And he's doing his little jumping routine. Ah, oh, okay. oh, I moved right into it. I moved right into it. I think we can slow him. A lot of bombs going about. The doors are open. Oh, dude, the bomb coins are crazy. They're everywhere. I just want to freeze them and get on my day. Ow. That one blew up when I tried to crack it. Didn't know that could happen. At this point, I'm just accepting the damage for what it is. Because he is dead. Oh, come on. You little goofball. You know you're dead. Don't play me like that. There you go. That was a really fun run and a cool showcase of a little bit of mod tweaking that we did as per your guys' suggestion. Either way, I hope you guys did enjoy. Um, and yeah, I guess I will see you guys in the next one.